Okay, chat. Damn, the entire chat is just commands. It's like a feral beast. Isn't that crazy? Like, oh my goodness. It, it's a little crazy. Do it right now? Do what right now? Okay, chat, hold on. We're getting the list pulled up. We're getting the commands pinned. It's um it's fouler first. It is fouler up first. Alright, Vis what? Wait. Oh no, Visania is up. Wait, what? No, it isn't. Wait, how did that happen? Wait a minute. Wait, did they tie for first and it just did Visania first? Yeah, it did. It did. You guys, they, they put you both as number one. But yeah, technically Fowler is up second and Visania is first. It's a three-way tie? You guys are crazy. Oh my god, okay, yeah. It's Visania, then Fowler, and then Hubert. That's the order on the um, on the Nightbot. That's the order. I'll leave. Dude, you're literally next. Do not leave. You're literally next. There are three firsts. Yes, there are. I'm just doing it in the order. Let Fowler go first, because I'm still preparing this. This messes up the entire... Ugh. Can you... Can, like... This wouldn't happen if chat wasn't so, like, feral when it comes to, like, the queue. Like, oh my god. <laughs> chat, you guys are insane. Alright, Fowler can go. And then we'll do Visania. Alright. <sighs> All right. You going Min Min? I am. Let's do this. Let's go, chat. This is Visenya's Ike. This matchup is supposed to be really good for Min Min, I think, but I, it hasn't stopped me from losing it before. Because who the hell plays Ike? I have not played since um, Thursday. Double jump Nair, as you do. It's a classic. Double jump Nair is a classic. But yeah, I'm a little, um... I'm a little rusty, so... Might take a game. That meant to be dash attack. And I bet that meant to be 20 other things that it wasn't. Wow. How is Ike so mid? Because, like, here's the thing. I don't actually think Ike is, like, unusable. I just think he's so exponentially mid that, like, he's he's become, bad, like, worse than he actually is. Because, like, you can't even cheese people. You know what I'm saying? Like... If you're a K-Rule main, 
Like, yeah, K. Roll's a really bad character, but you can cheese the hell out of people. Same thing with DDD. You know what I'm saying? There's cheese to make things more bearable. But Ike doesn't even have that. Also, that didn't kill. I low-key think it should have, but I think it was some sort of hit hitbox jank. Where it was like, I got a sour spot. I can actually punish quick draws landing. Yeah, I don't know what these up smashes are, but they haven't they haven't been doing it for you. Dude, swapping arms in between, um, like, like swapping between your arms for a tech chase situation is low-key really good. Thank you for your daily uploads. It makes my day better. Well, thank you, Dodo. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Min Min airspeed is terrible. It's not that bad. I mean, like, I don't know. Min Min is so weird because, like, whether or not you need to stay grounded or whether or not you should really challenge someone in the air is kind of matchup dependent. <laughs> okay, I can I can work with this. Three, two, Let's do this. One, go. This matchup is not bad. Like you may think, I don't know. This this matchup is really easy. To lose, I think. I think this matchup's easy to lose. Like, you know when Sonics did that matchup chart where he didn't rank it on like how good it was, but on how like hard it was? I think this matchup would definitely be very like easy to lose for Min Min, right? Just because of the superficial similarities to like Puff and like the really good edge guarding and the good combo game and stuff like that. But in reality, this matchup is definitely like even at worst. Like, on paper, this matchup is even at worst. I don't actually think that... I don't think Kirby loses to Min Min anymore. Or Kirby um, beats Min Min. I think this matchup... There is one thing I really dislike about it. It's that. At this point, when Kirby has Min Min's arm, this just becomes the Min Min Ditto with a character who is way better at going off stage. Like, it's kind of insane how much I really dislike it when Kirby has my ability. Okay. I thought I thought they definitely dropped through flat. I don't think this matchup's that bad, though. I just really, like, Kirby having arms is really annoying. I was, yeah, I was holding straight up. Because I was trying to jump. I don't have, like, stick jump on, but I was, like, I was, like, drifting upwards from my jump. So, yeah. And DI there was infinitely trash. I actually had, like, a read there. But yeah, if you get edge guarded, this matchup sucks. Really? No way, bro. 
Oh my god, I lived, by the way. I didn't mean to footstool. Are you gonna taunt me? Nah, -uh. hold on. I'm locked in. I don't mean to forward air there, dude. I keep getting forward airs. When I mean to go for Nairs. God, GG's, GG's, man, okay. Man, man. That was stressful. My goodness. I didn't, I, yeah, Battlefield, terrible stage for that matchup, let me say. Oof, Battlefield is rough. Kirby can't approach? Yeah, you're right. It seems a little counterintuitive, but Kir Kirby's, like, slower airspeed is actually pretty detrimental. Okay, so I'm gonna do I'm gonna do the next command. It but Vis it's Visania's turn. It's not Fowler again. It's Visania's turn. Kirby up B beats Min Min Arms. Yeah, but like not when you land. I can clank with it. When I can I can still two frame you with it. It can clank. All right, let's do this. It's gonna be Wario. Okay, it is. Let's do this. This is this is one of those matchups where I'm like, this should be even, but it's a little difficult. I really struggled hitting that, um, I just didn't angle my ram ram. I might have two framed if I had. Getting grabbed there sucks. Because I lose my dragon arm. I'm definitely tryharding a little, I think. Nice! Ah, I meant to grab the bike and throw it off. I'm dead. I really thought I could live that for a second there. Uh, I meant to grab the bike and throw it off really quickly. I, You know what I should have done? 
when I grabbed on the ledge, I shouldn't have tried to get back immediately. I should have tried just hanging there. Because maybe the bike could have missed me. If I, if I had. But by jumping there, I'm just guaranteed that I got hit by the bike. Which is a guaranteed loss of stock. Oh my god. If you had read my air dodge with a waft instead, I actually do think I would have died. Oh my god, are you dead? You are! Dang! Oh my goodness. That's crazy. Kirby Nair clanks with Min Min Arms. That's interesting. Both of them? It probably won't clank with Megawatt in that case. <clears throat> Town and City was a really good stage for me to get. Pikachu's busted? I kind of agree, yeah. Oh, isn't, um, there's a major happening this weekend, right? My Asuma? Or, no, it's Asumabato. It's Asumabato. I don't know if that started, because Japanese majors usually, like, take place on, like, Fridays, and they finish on Fridays. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I don't know. It might be going already. How's your day going? It's going pretty well. Thank you for asking. This is going to be an interesting match. Three, two, one, go! Oh my god, how did I not die? <clears throat> GG's, GG's. I, I literally wouldn't have made that back. I fast fell so hard. I definitely die there. <laughs> I definitely was dead. GG's. Chat. Here's the thing about Min Min Rob. I have played it a lot. You know what I'm saying at this point? So, like, I don't think I can get counterpicked with, like, a pocket Rob. But I think if someone switches, like, if their Rob is real... I think that's when I really start to have problems. Okay, so now we can go next. Okay, so we're back. The queue is fine. Don't have to worry about anything no more. It's, um... It said it's Fowler. That's... Oh, it's Hubert's turn. Okay, I guess the queue was still messed up after all. Okay. Oh, we're just going. It's Hubert's turn, though. It's Hubert's turn. My goodness. <laughs> Min Min Rob is heaven. No, it isn't. That matchup's hell. I hate Rob. Least favorite character in the game.
Bro sucks for Min Min. You know? I actually think this matchup, a lot of people are like, oh my gosh, guys, no, this matchup's good. Especially pit mains. Pit mains are like, oh, this matchup is like even at worst. We win this, right? I actually do not think the pits win this matchup. I think their air speed is really bad. And like, I think the pits actually do have some trouble getting in. Which is obviously the main concern for anyone fighting Min Min. I just don't think they're fast enough to get in consistently. That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. It seems way better than Dark Pit due to light arrows. I definitely do think it's easier in that regard. But I don't know. I think the problems in neutral for the pits don't they they're not fixed by light arrows, so I think the pits still can struggle in this matchup. Pit murders Minmin off stage? Not really. To be honest. Not more so than like any other character. You just kind of have to be good and like not burn your jump and stuff. Yeah, I don't think the pits do that much off stage that other characters can't do better. Cause like most pits, when Min Min is off stage, they'll go for one of two things. They'll either go for an arrow or they'll go for like drop down Nair, right? Because Nair sends out a really good outward angle uh, like, fair is more of a disjoint, but I think a lot of pits go for Nair instead. Um, and in that situation, I still think pit's air acceleration is not good enough to, like... Like, if like you can react to whatever they're going to do or predict whatever they're going to do. The only, like... If they read you, yeah, you'll still die. If they get, like, a good read on, like, oh, you're going to jump right now. But that's why you just have to mix up your recoveries... Not waste your jump. Just the typical things like that, really. And none of that is really unique to Pit. Every character makes Min Min go through that. That's just the fundamental weakness of this character. So, okay, this specific pit, going for so many drag down F smashes or drag down up smashes or down smash. Just like the drag down aerials are 
definitely their win condition at the moment, or at least this player's win condition. You're never ready for it. I started off in disadvantage, but... Ooh, I should be dead here, I think. Yeah, you see, like, I, I don't know. I don't know if Pit's edge guarding is really all that the Pit players make it out to be. It's, it's nothing that, like, Lucina doesn't do. You know what I'm saying? Just, like, drop down Nair and stuff. I got hit by one of those drag downs down smashes. That was a good bait. I, I thought they I definitely thought they weren't gonna grab. That was a good mix up. I was ready for it that time, though. I was trying to go out for an edge guard. Ah, oh, I meant to pivot, meant to pivot. Guess what? Fair enough. Nice, nice. Went out for the disjoint. Oh, fight up smashed. Dude, that's not it. Oh, that is it, though. Yeah, dropped the... Uh Orbitar is a little bit too early. Is that the name or is Orbitar's side B? Orbitar's is the shields, right? How is Min Min Steve? It's winning for Min Min, but I think it's like plus 0.5 because it's Steve. So you can always just kind of lose it. You know what I'm saying? Nightbot doesn't want to give me my position. Okay, it's because everyone is trying to do their command at the exact same time. Guys, I've reminded you. I, I, I say this like it's what seems like 10 times every stream. Um, if like there is a five second cooldown on Nightbot commands that is as low as I can get it, I can't get rid of it. If someone puts in a command and then you put in theirs right afterwards, they didn't see yours because they're still on the five second cooldown from the guy who input it right before you did. So if you didn't, if you put in a command and nothing happened and it was right after someone else did, just try it again when no one else is doing a command because Nightbot didn't see it. That is why sometimes people aren't in the queue when they think that they are, because they tried to join it right after someone else did, and the and then the command bot or night bot didn't see their join command. Do you want to die? So that can happen sometimes. Two, one, go. Sora matchup is interesting. I I think this matchup is like winning at a low mid level, but. I think this matchup is, I, I don't know, I haven't really played it at like the highest level. To where like, and by that I mean like, I haven't ever fought a Sora main who like, who really hits their zero to death combos. Like Kamehameha level style of precision. I've never fought a Sora like that before. I would imagine that matchup is even at best in that situation. Because in that, in that scenario like, if you die in one hit, Min Min is the perfect combo weight. 
So you honestly could just die. But at like low to mid level, at the very least, this matchup is winning, I think. I have Death Spade in my region. So you'd think I would have fought like that kind of Sora before, right? Except no, Death Spade just goes Bayonetta against me. Cause it's, it, cause he thinks it's the better matchup on paper. And yeah, I can definitely, I, I see the logic. Even with swords who aren't hitting everything per se, the combos on this character can still be annoying. Try to hit me with the K roll maneuver. Sorry, F smash hits me on ledge? What? What do you mean F smash hits me at ledge? Also, my up smash did not hit. The hell is that BS? Did you see what I did there? I went off stage to try an edge guard, but what ended up happening was the auto aim on Sora's side B went towards me. It went down. And because of that, Sora couldn't recover afterward. I literally got the kill there by going off stage and just doing nothing. That's crazy. How do you do Yo how does Yoshi do versus Sora? I'm not entirely sure. I my my first suspicion is even. I've seen Justin and Despade play that matchup a ton. And it's like, yeah, sword. And Yoshi doesn't like swords. But every single like I don't know. I feel like people and Justin would agree with me too. People are like way too hesitant or way too um eager to call a matchup losing for Yoshi just because a character has a sword. Like Yoshi does not lose to every sword character. Yoshi actually does pretty well against quite a few of them. Um, but like, but I don't know because I feel like Yoshi could probably double jump armor out of, of a lot of Sora combos. So yeah, my first instinct is to say even. And I know that um, at certain times, uh, Despade has preferred that matchup over Bayonetta against Yoshi. But they kind of go back and forth between um, Despade swapping characters. I meant to Nair for that up B and that back air. That both, they both meant to be Nairs. I'm... Yeah, I'm, I, I just die. That's a brutal angle. No. You're not cheesing me. I cheese you.
I went, I, I literally went lower. <sighs> there, yeah, just, just honestly just fishing for a grab and to like back throw. That's what they're fishing for at the moment. So I might just like stop shielding for a bit because they're just fishing for grab at this point. Okay, that was F tilt and he died at 80. That had to have been DI. There's no way you were like DIing that properly. That's what I mean, though, when I say I, you don't cheese me, I cheese you. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, come on. I thought up smash would have enough time for me to punish, but guess not. Min Min grab is really slow, and I really should never be using it in the corner. But the, the urge to back throw up smash cheese is too strong. I know I shouldn't be using back throw in the corner. But the parasites, the parasites want me to fish for grab at ledge. I think you might be dead. Okay, would have been dead if you had gone for side B. I didn't know whether or not that was going to cross up. <gasps> that's it! Oh, wow. GG's. Well, that's an anticlimactic way for that to end. Min -min. What would you say Ridley Min Min is? Uh, plus one Min Min. It's like, the only thing Ridley has in that matchup is edge guarding. Which is, like, decent. But not good enough for it to be even. Like, neutral in that matchup is horrendous for Ridley. Like, so bad. ZSS back throw mentality? True. <laughs> PS2 moment. Yeah. GG's, GG's. Reversals are too good in this game for being greedy to be worth it. Yeah, that's fair. Didn't know auto aim. Didn't know that was an auto aim for Sora. Yeah. Uh, Sora can choose whether or not they control it or whether or not it's auto aim. They can choose. And in that specific situation at the end of game one, they auto aimed and then they realized, oh crap, I'm going down to the blast zone. So then they tried to manually go back upward, but it wasn't enough. Side B is such an overrated Sora move. It's way easier to hit than Sonic's neutral B. And it's so busted. Screw that move. Don't you mean underrated if you're trying to say that it's broken? Oh, my next didn't go through because someone else did position. Oh my gosh. Okay, stuck in a bucket. You're next. Hop in. That's not stuck in a bucket. Is it? I don't think that's stuck in a bucket. Ready? Hold on, is this you, Bucket? Not me. All right, uh, Jorks, can you please exit the arena? You have to uh, wait your turn. Don't make me kick you, because if I kick you, then you might not be able to come back in when it is your turn. Don't make me do it. Alright, Bucket, you can come in. Bucket, hop in it, Bucket. What is your switch name, Bucket? I don't quite remember. <laughs> I guess I, I'll recognize it, I'm pretty sure. I just don't remember, though. Oh, yeah. That's what it is. <laughs> Forgot about that. <laughs> I'm in. Mm, wow. Okay, okay. Another Ike. We're gaming. It's time to game. Three. 
My Wi-Fi has been in and out lately because of wind and rain. That's fair enough. Damn, I, I, that was a critical flub. That was a critical whiff on my part. I burned my jump way too early. I just assumed I was going to be able to get back. That was a critical whiff. I got this. One good uh, dragon laser combo and I'm back in it. It's an even game again. Gotta be more careful with that down air. That was my fault. Jesus, dude. Um, you're not dead, are you? I I'm missing so much that I really can't afford to be missing. Like those. If I'm gonna waste a jump trying to challenge him in the air, I need to hit it. Oh my god. Nice, nice, nice. Oh my god, there's like what three Ike mains in this chat right now? What the hell? That's crazy. How's the matchup for you with Young Link and Min Min? Like really volatile even, I think, in my opinion. I don't know. Young Link's combo game is really good, but he can struggle to get in. <sighs> okay, chat, we're gaming. Holy hell, that was such a tense game for no reason. I should not have, like, it should not have been that close. I literally, like, I don't know, my second stock too. I made a critical whiff with the down air. So I was just making really dumb mistakes. That was getting me killed. 
but as long as I can avoid being an idiot, I'll be fine. I should win handedly. As long as I can avoid being an absolute dumbass. Which is actually a lot easier said than done, especially for me. Certified idiot. Didn't realize Naito Sharp changed his tag to Leviathan. No way! Oh my god. Not again, chat. Oh no. I'm being so dumb. I don't know why I'm just, I like, I don't play very well against Ike for some reason. I don't know what it is. Maybe I should stay more like grounded. Maybe that's what I'm not doing at the moment. I am playing very air based, which might be not what I want to do. Oh my god. I almost actually killed off of that. I definitely think I could have. I don't. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That side B is. Oh my god. That side B is so good, actually, in this matchup. Oh my god. Really? No. Am I dumb? Oh my god. Can I stop being an idiot? Can I stop getting hit by side B? Uh, no. Come on. Listen. That's so... That would be so embarrassing if I got hit by that. Oh, I'm dead, aren't I? Yep. Okay, let me lock in. I'm playing so bad. I'm playing so bad. Ike dash attack online? True, but like, mmm. But also, ugh. I can do this. I, j I really need like a good stage. That's what I really want. I, I want like town. Kalos was also pretty decent. I don't like this stage actually. I actually really would have preferred something much bigger. It's okay though. I'm sorry. I can. I didn't mean to grab. I meant to down tilt. But I can nair clanks with arms? You're not for real, are you? Oh my god, what the hell? Every time I think he's gonna have to use up B and then he doesn't.
Wait. I think I get it. That hit me? Why did he shield that time? Or why didn't he shield that time? Just stay away from that ledge. No way! I have to lock in. Locked in. Min -min wins. I locked in, chap. The parasites. The parasites told me to fish for back throw at ledge. And I listened to the parasites. Oh my god. <laughs> Here's the thing, I didn't even get the back throw F smash cheese. I didn't even get it. It's just like, I, I kind of like frame trapped where I'm like, okay, if you're not gonna get hit by that, I know you have to up B here. I have to hit this Ram Ram and I did. And I did. Jeez, I'm happy I locked in. Oh my God. I don't know why I'm struggling in that matchup. Why am I struggling against Ike? How? I don't even know. All right, well, Sean Isler is up next. Oh. Okay. Lucina versus Min Min, what are your thoughts? It's not unwinnable, but it is strong Min Min favor. Like, maybe plus one. What about Min Min Corrin? I think Min Min actually loses that matchup, like minus 0.5. Is this you, Will Sean? And you're lucky because I main Ike, so you get to play him again? Fair enough. How much longer are you streaming today? Uh, we've been live for about an hour, so about an hour and a half more. But yeah, Min Min Corrin, I actually think is losing for Min Min because Corrin's combo game is so good. Corrin can go out so deep for edge guards. Like the neutral B is really good for sniping off stage. The back air is ridiculous. You can't two frame Corrin's up B with Ram Ram. Like you'll die early with the uh, neutral B. I just don't think how- I just don't see how people think that matchup is winning for Min Min. I don't see it. Like, there's so much going for, um, for Korn in that matchup. The F-Smash shield break is crazy. And I'm still, like- like, I know how I'm supposed to beat it, but I've still never successfully gotten out of it. Even with the knowledge that I'm supposed to, like, use the B button when I'm holding shield, because I only have one shield button, chat. Keep in mind, I can't hold multiple shield buttons to do it. I only have one shield button. So I know that I'm supposed to um, use the B button while I'm in shield. I don't know, I've just, I've never gotten out of it before.
This matchup is all about killing Terry before he can use his go moves on you. I don't know why I rolled out in that situation. I should have rolled in. Damn, I just, I, I hate Terry. I, I, I've been beating him a lot of the times and I, the matchup is good. I just really hate fighting this character because you just can't punish him for anything. He's just like cool game and watch. That's all Terry is, in my opinion. Terry is just like socially acceptable game and watch. And honestly, it's like, oh, you just, you just can't punish, just can't punish anything. That's what, that's the only thing I hate, really. He can just kind of like, especially online, it's so hard to punish anything that Terry wants to do to you. Okay. Jeez, dude. Terry being the Game & Watch of Shoto's is an incredibly base statement. Oh, thanks. Game & Watch in human form. Chat, there's like, okay, okay, there's Game & Watch. Terry is the Shoto Game & Watch. Corrin is the Sorty Game & Watch. Like, who's, who's like, I guess Game & Watch is the Brawler Game & Watch. I don't know. <laughs> Who's like a zoner game and watch? Maybe Samus. Samus would not be a terrible answer to that. Because her moves kind of connect one, into each other. Go. Min Min Bear is better than Fair. It's basically the same move, isn't it? I'm just like, at, at that point in the game, I know Terry wants to get in no matter what. So like, I'm like, Terry is much more vulnerable to like, just backdash F smash. Cause they're so desperate to hit their go moves. too much. You're right. Ah, 
Damn. My spacing is off on this stage. Yes! I got, I got lucky with that one. I was able to capitalize on that situation. It's, yeah, this matchup really is just don't let Terry use go no matter what. You see, I rolled there again, despite saying I rolled too much. Because no mix-up is sometimes the best mix-up. That's it. All right, GG's, GG's. Oh, crack shoot is annoying to deal with. Yeah, Roy is Sorty Game and Watch. Nah, 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 nah. That's Corin. It's Corin for sure. Why is everyone using Persona music every time? What do you mean? Persona music's good. Ugh. All right, GG's, GG's. Chat. Yeah, I don't know. That matchup's good. I've gotten a lot better at it than I used to be. You know? If Plant is Game & Watch, I'm dropping him immediately. I don't think Plant's Game & Watch. You play Min Min so perfectly? I appreciate that. I actually think I'm... It's far from perfect. <laughs> Let's, like, Doramigi is perfect with his play. I am nowhere near that yet. Opinion on Min Min Wii Fit? Like... It's pretty good for Min Min. Like, deep breathing can mess you up, but, like, you can swat away soccer ball with ease. You can challenge Wii Fit offstage without going off stage. Huge. Um, I just, like, you can reflect Sun Salutation, but, like, that's not really a huge deal. I, I, th I think the matchup's really good for Min Min. Is this Riddle's Dormigi reenacted? Gosh, maybe. Santiago Martinez is up next. Santiago Martinez. Feels more than pretty good, a low to mid level. Feels like more than pretty good. I can't crack it. Oh. Oh, you're the. Are you the Wii Fit in this equation? Are you a Persona fan? I am. I'm playing through Reload right now, Persona 3 Reload, with my partner. We play the game together. I probably would be done with the game already if I was just playing it on my own, but we're playing it together, so we're. So I have to wait for them to show up to play it, except for like grinding Tartarus. We Fit can't plank against that character? Yes. Yes, We Fit can't really plank against Min Min. That's why I think it's a really good matchup. But, like, it's not unwinnable because deep breathing is pretty good if you get in. But, like, I think We Fit definitely has a much harder time than most of the cast. But We Fit mains are still in my replies of every single matchup chart I've ever made trying to convince me that that matchup is even or even We Fit favored. Like, the delusion okay sorry i have to i had to rant a little bit because every single low tier and mid tier main thinks they beat min min and they don't banjo kazooie does not beat min min you guys are crazy dr mario is even at best and a solid even at best all right you guys are delusional it's like uh i'm sorry don't know much about min min is terry versus min min and min min's favor i think it's plus one I think it's plus one Min Min. I play Bowser Jr. and Duck Hunt. Neither of them beat Min Min. I think Bowser Jr. could be even, but I don't think I don't think it's losing. Plant hard wins, Min Min. I'm just saying. Okay, okay, chat. Okay. I don't think Santiago's here, so we're gonna go next. The Wii Fit players are coping. I mean, if you play a low tier, mid tier, maybe high of mid tier character, I understand why you'd want to believe, you know. Commander Calico is up next.
Dude, I got my first fusion accident in Persona 3 Reload today. What character even makes Min, Min struggle? I think her worst matchups are Meta Knight, Greninja, um, Pikachu. Those are the ones that I would consider to be minus two. And then the minus ones, I think, are Rob, Puff, Sheik, and... That might be it, to be honest with you. There might be another in there. ZSS, you could maybe put in there. ZSS is pretty good. Falco, I'm starting to think is even. Oh, Yoshi. I'll, I'll put Yoshi in the minus ones as well. I'll put Yoshi down there too. Ready? I have come around to that matchup being losing. How about Greninja Min Min? Here's the thing, I've never played against a Greninja offline because the only people who play Greninja in my region secondary them and they main Falco, which is not a terrible matchup. So they'd rather just go their main instead of, do, like, even though it's like a better matchup on paper, they'd rather just go their main. And I haven't really beaten any of them yet, so I understand. Um, so I haven't really actually fought Greninja offline at like my same skill level. So like, I'm not entirely sure how it goes, but what from what I've heard and what I've seen, that matchup is terrible for Min Min. It is really, really bad. In fact, I've even heard it described as unwinnable. I think, I know that Ice Knight thinks that you should never lose that matchup as Greninja unless you're just playing like way worse than the Min Min player. So like, I know Ice Knight the Greninja thinks that that matchup is unwinnable for Min Min. Damn. I was drifting out. So yeah, I'm lucky that the Greninja players don't want to use Greninja with me. Lucas does not beat Min Min. Min Min is one of Lucas's worst matchups. Are you kidding? And also, someone asked about Captain Falcon. Captain Falcon, Min Min is even, in my opinion. But it's a really volatile matchup. I have this uh, really talented Falcon main in my region. <coughs> and our sets always go back and forth and whatnot. But what happens is, like, I'll three stock him game one, and then game two, I'll get three stocked. It's volatile. And you'll just take turns, like, owning each other. In my, in my opinion, I generally think the better player will win. But, like, you really have to be ready to take advantage of, like, volatile assets, like, dying at 20 never getting in, only spending the entire game in disadvantage. Like, you have to be ready for that kind of thing. But I think in general, the better player does often win Falcon Min Min. And I think, I think that matchup's even. Why is Meta Knight so bad for Min Min? So the traditional wisdom is that Min Min really loses to Puff and Sheik. And Meta Knight is kind of if you put Puff and Sheik together into one character. Uh, can edge guard exceptionally well. Some of the best edge guarding against Min Min on the cast. Has multiple jumps, so you can just kind of get over a lot of uh, Min Min's stuff. Has decent air acceleration as well. So a lot of times you can jump over Min Min's things. And on top of that, like that's what Puff has, right? So that matchup's bad. What Sheik has is an amazing combo game. And Meta Knight also has that. Ladder combos? Min Min is the perfect combo weight. So you will die to ladder combos. To a Meta Knight who knows what they're doing, you can kind of just get zero to death from the ladder combos extremely frequently. There you go. But, um, so yeah. I think Meta Knight is if you put Sheik and Puff together, then you get Meta Knight. And that's why I think that matchup is so bad. You can win it. I think it's winnable. But I still think it's probably Min Min's worst. Now, that's not my least favorite. My least favorite is Rob, actually. My, my least favorite matchup in the game is Rob, by far. Ever fought a good Meta Knight player? 
It depends on what your definition is. I've definitely fought some local Meta Knights that I would consider to be good players. You know what I'm saying? Um, I have never fought a, like a PR level Meta Knight. I'm very lucky that there aren't any in my region. And that's the thing about Min Min that I think is really interesting. Um, oh, Diddy Kong is also pretty bad for Min Min in my opinion. I think Diddy Kong is probably also a minus one. I didn't think about that. Um, one thing I really think is nice about Min Min is that a lot of her like unwinnable matchups or whatever, really rare characters. They're not very frequent. The most common bad matchups you'll have as a Min Min player are Rob and Diddy. Like, those are the big two ones that you are probably run into all the time. But, like, Sheik is fairly uncommon. Pikachu is fairly uncommon. Puff is fairly uncommon. Greninja is fairly uncommon. Like, a lot of these matchups, Meta Knight as well. Like, a lot of these matchups, like, people just don't really play those characters. Which I think, I think Min Min gets really lucky in that sense. Where they're like more rare. If if those characters were more common in like everyday local scenes and brackets, I think Min Min might actually drop like out of top tier. And in my in my opinion, in terms of like meta relevancy, Min Min like would legitimately get worse on the tier list if those characters were more frequent. I do think Min Min does need a bit of good bracket luck. Cause like, I don't know, volatile matchups can really mess up your day. And if you're doing like a bracket run, uh, it can be hard. Min Min, of the high tiers and the top tiers, I think that Min Min's actually probably the hardest bracket character to win with. I think Min Min is the hardest character to win like brackets with of the high tiers and the top tiers and i'm not taking that back i i fully do believe that she's a she's a pretty difficult character i thought that would kill actually oops <laughs> i love up throw Okay. Why no one play Pokemon characters? I don't know. They're all busy playing Pokemon Unite. All the Pokemon fans, bro. Is that it? It is. GG's, GG's. It's pretty hard being a top tier zoner. Min Min isn't just mashing? Yes, you're correct. Who do you think is the most overrated character in Smash Ultimate? God, that's hard. Hmm. Interesting question. God, um, am I crazy for saying right now it might be Banjo? Am I crazy? Um, all right, Ayo Loki's up next. How is Sora Min Min? I, I explained it a little bit earlier, but I think at a low to mid level, it's plus one for Min Min. But I think if you're like a Kamehameha level player and you're hitting those combos, mm, dude, I think it might be even. I think it might be even. And then it was how, wait, haven't played Smash for a few months. Should I get Nintendo online? I think so. You think Sephiroth regular link is overrated? Those top level Banjo wins though? No, you're right. Absolutely. I think Tori Goody, I think Tori Goody is just cracked though. Like. People are like picking up Banjo now, and I'm like, I don't think this is really gonna last very long. 
Like, I think everyone who's picking up Banjo right now will realize that they're not him. Like, they're not him. They are not Hemi Neutron. And they're gonna drop him again. That's what I think is gonna happen. Low key. <clears throat> hey, Jerry Jones. How's it going? Yeah, I, I definitely think Toadie Goody is just that guy. And yeah, I think I think very soon pe all the people like picking him up, like guys, secret top tier hidden in plain sight. I think they're gonna drop him again as soon as they realize that. Wait a minute, Banjo was one of the like most f badly skewed, um, like input output characters of all time. You put so much into Banjo. And you get almost nothing out of it. You have to put in so much. Like, Tori Goody has to literally put in, like, the amount of work it took to conquer nations to, like, play this character at a, at a high level. I'm sorry, but you're not doing that at your local with your new, with your new pocket banjo you're picking up to counterpick Steve with. Like, that's not gonna happen. No, I didn't. I buffered it. I buffered it, chat. I buffered it. I, I think I had a jump and I could have lived there. That's okay. We take those. ISD, USD. I don't know who's the most overrated in the history, like, of all time in Ultimate. I'm just saying, I think a lot of people are freaking out about Banjo right now, and they shouldn't be. They should be freaking out about Toadie Goody, not Banjo. You know what I'm saying? I think people, I think people like, aren't really talking enough about how good that player is because they've all convinced themselves that his character was like this secret high tier the entire time. That's what, that's kind of what I'm getting at. I don't think people are like, people aren't giving Toadie Goody enough credit. Joining the queue is exclamation mark join. Someone asked what Min Min Inkling is like. Um, I think that's even, but it's hard when the Inkling starts to camp you because then it's like, oh God, you know? Pokemon trainer overrated or underrated? I think it's underrated. This is Axe Pikachu all over again. I agree. What's up? What's up? Let's go Bubblegum. How's it going? How's it going? Who has the best recovery? Um, probably Snake. It's infinite, right? So probably snake. Uh, da, da, da. Okay. But yeah, someone said Rob. Ready? I don't know what question that was answering. It might have been the recovery one. But yeah, I'm sorry. There's a lot of people in the queue right now. Same with MKLeo's Byleth and SkyJ's Incineroar. Yeah, I think it's exactly like that. Two, one, go. It's pretty vulnerable. Okay, what's our criteria for best recovery then? Is it, is it like, is it just raw distance? Is it how safe it is? Is it a combination, like in general? I still think snakes is pretty good. I don't think it's that vulnerable. Nice. Rob, you guys are brain lagging. Nah, I don't I don't think Rob has the best recovery. Like it's really long. But you can you can run out of gas, unlike someone like Snake who can just keep going over and over again.
Meta Knight recovery does everything. Except for the fact that it's not... I don't know. Can't you two-frame it? I still think Snakes is the best overall. Sora's might be pretty good, too. I, I think Sora's is definitely up there. For, for distance-wise. What the hell was that? He was yellow for, like, a solid minute. Like, what? This character doing weird things to us, chat. Bro, he said yacht. Did you hear it? Watch this drive. Oh, bye bye. Bye bye, dude. Bye bye. Banjo has a pad to keep his defensive tools and he can blow. What? Hey, yo, you gotta, you gotta work on your phrasing here, Mr. Durad. You gotta, you gotta, like, you gotta work on your phrasing, dude. Let me read out this message exactly how it's written. Banjo has a pad that keep his defensive tools and he can blow himself and he has Wonder Wing. Like, you gotta work on your phrasing there a little bit, man. Oh my goodness. GG's AO Loki, GG's. Best recovery is Sora. I think it's between Sora and Snake in my opinion. Pikachu's is pretty good. I think Pikachu's Pikachu's recovery may actually be the best if we consider best recovery in terms of like how useful is it in their game plan. Because without Pikachu's great recovery, he couldn't circle camp. So that might be the best recovery if our criteria for best recovery is like how often do you use it within your game plan? You know what I'm saying? Um yeah, BO3, it's all BO3 and Ben Ross, you're up next. Game & Watch, not for recovery, but for upbeat. Game & Watch definitely has one of the best upbeats in the game. That's true. YouTube chat roasting. Here we go. I'm not trying to roast you. I just, like, I looked over and I started reading your message and I went... Hold on. <laughs> I went, wait a minute. Let me, let me, let me, like... Let me rephrase this message before I end up getting clipped out of context talking about Banjo blowing himself like, whoa, hold on now. <laughs> it's crazy. All right, here we go, Ben Ross. Inkling Uppy is surprisingly good at edge guarding. That's true. No, that's actually true. It's true, chat. Let's do this. Oh crap. Okay, okay. Okay, chat. Okay, chat. Let's do it. Okay. Three, With the grenade? Two, yes, one, that is true. Go. I think Banjo's recovery is pretty good. I'm so confused on how that hit. What?
Really? No kill. Oh, it went so deep for it. There was nothing I could do. I should have just tried to get some extra chip damage because I, I felt like I knew I was dead. the combos. There we go. Okay, okay. Oh, we're chilling. <laughs> Meta Knight is bad? Chat, I don't know about that one. Okay, probably getting the Shulk now. What do you think about Ike Min Min? It's winning for Min Min. But I've struggled in it for some reason. Alright, here we go. Oh. This matchup can be annoying. I've just got to play it good. Jump. I definitely think jump art is one of the most annoying parts about this matchup. Oh my god. Oh. I hate that there's no way for me to quickly turn around in the air. I actually get hit by backslash a ton in this matchup. There's no way for Minmin to quickly turn around in the air. Meaning that if I happen to be facing the other way, he can he can just like kind of mash it in a way. Oh my god, I just... <sighs> this matchup is stressful. That's what it is. It's stressful. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I don't know if there was anything I actually could have done there. Really? That didn't hit.
I just think every Monado art is really annoying to deal with. Great. Thank God I didn't get edge guarded there. If I did, oh, I would have cried. Oh, is he dead? Yeah, you're dead. Nice. GG's, GG's. Min Min is annoying too. Slight Min Min favor. Cloud recovery can be exploitable. I think Cloud Min Min's even though. Sheik versus Min Min, I think is minus one. Other people think it's minus two. Um, yeah. And Meta Knight is worse than me, Sword Fighter? That's just not true. We go next. That's, you know what that's called? That's called recency bias. Uh. Mm -hmm. Oh, my back. Nice. Oh, my God. Oh. Whew, my back is crazy. My goodness. I've been here for a good minute. Oh, I didn't. The next didn't go through. Do you have a Min Min amiibo? Nope, but I have a Ganondorf amiibo. Cause you went, you know, why not, <laughs> right? Uh. Do you have a cat? Hell yes, I do. I'm gonna go bald mode? Bald mode? Well, let me let my hair down then. If you're gonna lose your hair, let me get more of mine. Ryan Odell is up. Chat, there's the hair. Oh, it's undertone! I didn't know that's your- Oh, I didn't recognize you literally at all. I'll absorb your hair. Chat. Here we go. This is someone- This from my local scene. Local, local. Are we doing it? We're doing it! We're doing it! Let's do this. I got a win on a spin a trap again last night. I lost the run back in losers, but I got a like spin a trap has literally whooped me the last like three times. But I took another win on him last night in Redemption Bracket. I was like, what changed between uh what I was like, what changed between you being like not beating me and then being like winning three in a row? And spin a trap was like Oh, I talked to Undertone, and I went, no! <laughs> no! <laughs> I can't believe it! Oh my god, how am I not dead from that? I really hate Battlefield. I low-key think, I don't know, Ryu might be plus one still. I do think Ken might be at even though. I know Time Gear actually thinks that Ken is a losing matchup for Min Min. I don't know if I believe that all the way. Nice. Gotta lock in. Yeah. 
didn't mean to do that dash attack. Watch this shit. Oops. The comebacks. The comebacks. Dude, you won't believe it. Uh, at battle phase uh, two nights ago, I got a three stock comeback on stream, dude. <laughs> I was like, I was being so devious. I was being devious. And then on the night before that, uh, at the JCCC local, I reverse three stocked a hero player. I got two reverse three stocks in the span of two days. And I beat Gage. I beat Gage at um at battle phase. Like the Gage was a top eight seed, and I was like the 16th seed, and I beat them in a game five set. Clutch as hell! Because I made an insane comeback in game four. And in game five, I SD'd at 22% and still won. Mostly because of the fact that they made a critical error off stage, their last stock. And I was able to basically abuse it with Ram Ram and get a kill at like 60-ish. They basically just burnt their jump really early. And I caught it with Ram Ram. What a call out. How do I miss that? And how do you have such little ant landing lag after that whiffs? Like what a critical miss. Thankfully I didn't take any more percent between then and actually getting the stock. If I had, it would have been a much, a far more critical miss. Whoa. Whoa, my entire screen froze. Chat, did that show up on stream or was that just a me thing? Was I the only one who saw that? My entire screen froze for like a solid two seconds. I'm playing bad now, hold on. We saw it. Okay, good. I'm glad I don't seem crazy at the very least. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm dead though, actually. I can make this comeback. I did it last game. And this is a better stage. 
No way! I was at almost a full shield! I didn't expect that to shield break me that early. That's rough. That 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 second stock, dude, I lost that because of the screen freezing. That's so tragic. Alright. Let's do it, so. Saw that, didn't have it on my end. I think it's a thing with, like, streaming. I think the computer was like, hold on, <laughs> we need a moment. But I did not have a moment to spare. I couldn't afford to spare them a moment. Crazy third game. Crazy third game. <laughs> Chat. Whew, okay. Plant enjoyer 69. Nice. <laughs> GG's appreciate you. Appreciate you too. Spinach Rap told me that was like, I talked to Undertone about how to beat you. And he was like, you just gotta get, learn Rister Mice's pattern. You just gotta learn his flow. And I was like, I put my face into my hands because I've heard the exact same thing like 50 times. I'm just like, I just need to stop being so predictable in every aspect of my play because <laughs> I'm really just becoming a Castlevania boss. That's all I am. I'm a Castlevania boss where I'm throwing out all this stuff. But if you know the pattern, you just get through it and win. And I'm like, oh no, I cannot become a Castlevania boss of Smash. That just, it, it, that can't be allowed to happen. <laughs> It's just so hard to like change. Cause it's like, it's one thing to know where it's like, oh, I'm being too predictable. But then it's another thing to be like, okay, how do I stop being predictable? You know what I'm saying? I'm like, what? I don't know. It, the, Cause that's like a psychological thing, bro. How do I, how do I like affect someone's mentality of me? That's crazy. Okay. Yeah, it is flippers up next. What's the worst m matchup for Min Min in your opinion? I think it's still Meta Knight. It like it like I think the other con cont contenders are Pikachu and Greninja. Um, at least in my opinion. I mean, like I don't think Puff is that bad actually, and I, I haven't really fought too many good Sheiks. But I don't I don't know if that matchup's that bad. Here's the thing about it: I have not fought a good Greninja. So I would really like to like do that because I really want to know what that matchup like. Is that hopeless? Is that matchup just despair on a plate? Despair. Hope. Despair. Oh. 
Ooh, what was that combo? When you combo one arm into the other, it's the most satisfying noise ever, dude. I swear to God, it really is. Okay. Ugh, that's so, it's such a terrifying, like... That's such a terrifying spot to be in against Ridley. Tried to hit Nair out of shield, but the jump got caught. I know Flippers loves to um, up B in neutral. That's what I'm really looking out for at the moment. I'm not gonna lie, I should have really gotten a kill there. Me not getting a kill there is definitely a whiff. I could have lived if I'd gone high, I think. Are you dead? No way. Oh, wow. That's crazy. Why would you up be in neutral? Who knows? Oh, man. <clears throat> That's crazy. <clears throat> Bad for Min Min, but he has to use pit air speed to get away. Hold on, who? Meta Knight has pit air speed though? Maybe Greninja is worse. I don't know. A good Greninja is definitely hard. Personally, I hate Rob the most, but you know. I'm not sure fighting a Greninja specialist is a good idea. I just want to know how bad it is. Up being neutral for Min Min? No, 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 for Ridley, for Ridley. Thought I had an extra jump. I Giga Flare in neutral? <laughs> Based. Just gotta be careful. I, if I get like cheese with Ridley up B spike. Oh my god, wait, you're actually dead. You're actually dead! One good read, boys. One good read. Uh-oh. That was good. Fair enough. No! How did my grab not reach? That was like a pixel off. I was like, oh, I'll get the grab. Standing right there. Doing the up B. But like, I was like, wait a minute. There you go. I had plenty of time to react to that one. Yeah. 
Yeah, you had plenty of time to react to that one. So... Really? All right, GG's, GG's. Oof. Oh my goodness. Min -min wins. How do you like use Min Min arms? Uh, the A button controls the dragon arm, the one that always stays dragon, and the B arm controls, or the B button controls the B arm, which is the one where you swap between the um, swap between the different things. Min Min's cooking. My Min Min always cooks. My Min Min always cooks. chat watchdog is up next bubblegum's game and watch is coming along nicely heck yeah heck yeah the next ploopy the next ploopy i know the controls always get confused it's like i'm using two a buttons yes yes literally yes because min min technically doesn't have a side special so you can really do you really can think of it as two a buttons Okay. Oh? Swapping characters? Okay, wait, that's interesting. I feel like that's a much worse matchup. <laughs> Let's do it. I really did. I w if that if Ness had activated it, I 100% would have just rolled into it. falling for that. I'm going to lock in. No, I'm done. You're not hitting a single PK Thunder again. I'm done with that. I haven't fought a Ness who goes for this. Especially so often. You're just... You're just fishing for PK Thunder.
I'm so angry. What are you jo no, 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 no. We're running this back. I'm s no, <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm not losing this. I don't know what's going on here. I just kept getting hit by PK Thunder five times in a row. I don't know what the hell is going on. Ness is not bad for Min Min Chat. I've just never seen this kind of thing before, chat. That's all. I'm not used to fighting Ness in this way. He uses like five normals. The entirety of that last game. I don't know why I neutral get up. Dude, there's no way. This is the worst. I hate this. Joking! Okay, hold on. I'm locked in.
My thumb is starting to get a blister on it. <laughs> He's dedicated to the timeout. He is really dedicated to the timeout. Okay, I just gotta change my game plan. That's it. <sighs> just chilling. I can't get tilted, because if I get tilted, I'm gonna lose. Okay, let's get a good stage. Good stage, please, good stage. Town and city. I love town and city. I'm gonna take that every day. That's what you get. I was behind you. Everything is okay. I've still got a tremendous lead. Having basically FD 90% of the time a blessing. that you can cancel it like oh my god I would have loved to hang on to that rage for just a little bit longer. It's okay though. There's no way, dude. What's the crazy part? He's actually mixing up fairly like well about whether or not he's going to use the PK Thunder to hit me or do PK Thunder 2. Like he's actually mixing that part up pretty well. It's just why would you choose that aspect about Ness? To improve with, you know? No way. <sighs> okay. GG's. <sighs> Side relief. I believe. This is not a top level nest strat. No. <laughs> Chat, you're wrong. I'm I'm low key glad I'm low key glad I was Min Min though. Because like I don't know how else I would have challenged like the charging of the PK Thunder from a like a big distance. 
if I hadn't been able to just F smash laser. It is though. You're welcome to keep playing with the strategy. However you find the most fun is how you should play. Man, that was a stressful set. <laughs> Let me tell you. Okay, uh, what a f fool is up next. What a fool. We're chilling. All right, here we go. Yeah, GG's, GG's, and, dead, and GG's. That strat of how to shift the matchup chart, it's still a good matchup. I just, I've never been faced with that before. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. Why not? I think at low level, low to mid level, this matchup's actually fine. You gotta get like web JP level combos to really make this matchup feel miserable. That's, you know, that's something I always see in like comments on my YouTube shorts. You know what I'm saying? Where it's like, I'll be like, this character's worst matchup is this. And then comments will be like, actually, I main this character, and I'm always able to beat the O2er main of that matchup at my locals, so therefore, it couldn't possibly be that character's worst matchup. And I'm like, shut up. <laughs> I'm not gonna die from that. I'm like, have you ever considered that maybe the o 2 -er, who you always beat at your locals, isn't necessarily the best representative of the matchup at high level? Have you ever thought about that, YouTube Shorts commenters? Not even dead. That's crazy. Really? I, I, I really wanted an edge guard at that point. Cool, Min Min. So hard to get in, bro. Yeah. All right, well, there's still at least one more game. At most, two more.
All right, here we go. Here we go. Ooh, that meant to be down tilt. I don't know how I got F tilt out of that. I've been going solo minimum all day. I haven't even realized. Dude, we're just gaming. Min Min is never looking cool. Damn. I'll have you know, I think Min Min's design, like her, like just aesthetics design, is really cool. Probably because just the character design in arms in general is really good. Critical whiff for like them to not get a punish there. Bye bye You didn't hear me. You didn't hear me, did you? When I say bye bye and bye bye, what does that mean? It means you go bye bye. GG's, GG's, GG's. <laughs> like the new thumbnail? Thank you, Storm Blessed. Uh, this made my day as well as discovering the new Japanese skateboarding ninja warrior show. What? That sounds crazy. Like, in the good way. Not gonna lie, I meant to switch characters, but it wouldn't let me. Oh, interesting. Okay. Well, GG's either way. We go next. <laughs> do I make you angry? What do you mean, though? In what way? What do we? I don't know what the subject is. Those YouTube shorts commenters are already are trust their DR even though the chart and the medication is not good. There had to be some autocorrect involved in that message. GG, thanks for playing. Before I gotta head to work, yeah. GG, you too, no problem. All right, CMCD is up next. CMCD really is worth a search. All right, I believe you. <laughs> I don't know if the, I don't know if this person's here is the thing. You may have to skip them. C M C D or C McD? C McD? Is that their name? I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce it.
All right, we're gonna keep going then. Since I don't believe that they're here. Time to chill. Art anime is up next. It's art anime. Heck yeah, but thanks for the props chat and good the good bout good sir. All right Y'all have a good one till next time. See you later watchdog All right, our enemies on the way Chat watchdog was this is a good sport But wow, I was not prepared to fight him today <laughs> Dude, I was not prepared that game one. I was just like hold on Stop I'm getting hit by seven PK thunders. What is happening? <laughs> I've never seen this before All right, here we go. Ready? You know, it's kind of clear. Yeah, do we have to do this one? <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's do it. I can win this. I'm prepared. I'm already prepared. I'm just coming out the gate swinging. You're the one who's not prepared. You fight for your friends, I fight to win! Our mate? Am I tryharding against Ike? I might be. I might be. Min -min. I don't believe for a minute that this matchup is Ike favored. I'm sorry, Glitch in Black, but I don't believe that for a second. <laughs> Double jump! 
I told you not to double jump. Don't do it again. I'm going to be there. Don't roll out. Okay. I, I meant to say in. I said out just because. Here we go. Mm. Don't double jump! I'm calling it out, chat. I called it out so hard. Don't double jump! Oh no! That's it! Ah, you can't double jump! <laughs> I called out the double jump every time! No way! That's a rough one, GG's. That was a rough one. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know, I just, I just noticed that you just kept double jumping at a disadvantage, and I was like, okay, I can punish that. That's crazy. I think... Oh, no, that is the end. Okay, chat. With that, that is going to be the end of the stream today, everybody. Thank you guys so much for coming out. It's been an absolute pleasure to have you guys here. I don't think we lost a single set today. Chat, did we lose a single set? I actually don't think we have. I, didn't think we, I don't think we did lose a single set today. So... Extremely successful, all things considered. Um, but with that, we're going to go ahead and end the stream off here. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Thank you guys so much for coming out. It's been an absolute pleasure to have you guys here. And we're going to be doing the same thing tomorrow. So if you didn't get your chance today, be sure to come back tomorrow. Because your chances will still be really good to get a game in then. So with that, I'm going to see you guys uh, tomorrow. Have a great day, everyone. And I'll see you guys then. Have a great rest of your days. Farewell.